We do have to put this risk into context, though. Our children are seven times more likely to develop a brain tumor eating just a single hot dog a week than using a cell phone. In fact, if our children insist on wanting to be Oscar Mayer wieners, they are multiplying their odds of getting childhood leukemia by 950%. Diet is the number one cause of cancer. Cancer is therefore a preventable disease, but it does require major lifestyle changes. Only 5 to 10% of cancer is in our genes, our family history. The other 90 to 95% of cancer risk is caused by what we expose our bodies to. Of the 90 to 95% tobacco contributes about a quarter of the risk in the United States, there are some infectious causes, particularly in people with AIDS. But diet, if you include obesity and alcohol, makes up about 50% of our cancer risk. And cell phones, air pollution, x-rays, everything else all just fits in to that last 10 to 15%. Anything about our diet in particular? From a massive new study in Canada last year, total meat consumption was directly related to the risk of not only stomach cancer, but colon cancer, and rectal cancer, and pancreatic cancer, and lung cancer, and breast cancer, and prostate cancer, and testicular cancer, and kidney cancer, bladder cancer, and more leukemia as well.